to let me know Should I stay or should I go If you say that you are mine I'll be here till the end of time So you got to let me know Should I stay or should I go It's always tease, tease, tease You're happy when I'm on my knees One day is fine and next is black So if you want me off your back So come on and let me know Should I stay or should I go Should I stay or should I go now Should I stay or should I go now How's it going folks, this is where you know about another lesson and an amazing song as always today we're looking at The Clash and Should I Stay or Should I Go. Uh, I did a tutorial for this about eight years ago which was a good while ago now so if you want to do a retake, you know, a new video, better quality, better tutorial I think. Uh, now this is a great one to get down on an acoustic guitar, I'm going to show you all the technique and everything like that to make it sound like the record. Uh, now if you do want the chords, lyrics and the strumming pattern, as always I'm going to post it up on my Patreon page, so there'll be a link to that in the comments, I'll also put a link in the description. And the way that that works, you just click on that link, sign up for as little as a couple of quid a month and it gives you access to not only this song, pretty much everything I've done over the past sort of 15, 16 months now since I set the Patreon thing up. So there's a lot of stuff up there. There's some exclusive videos. There's a lot of videos there from the archive. And there's also stuff to coincide with the technique lessons if you're into the blues and the scale stuff that I've done before. It's all up there. So what are you waiting for? Link in the description, link in the comments. Uh, another way that you can show your appreciation if you don't want to do that, I've got a new feature which is like a super thanks link that's just under the video there, you can click on that and make a small donation, again very much appreciated and I can promise you that all the money generally goes back into the lessons. Uh, thanks everyone who's subscribed and continues to do so, now if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, a third way you could help me out is hitting that little notification bell that's somewhere down there so you get notified every time I post a video up and if you want to please go over and give me a like on social media, so I'm Wayne Our Guitar on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and now also TikTok as you always say, I'm trying to get down with the kids. Anyway that's enough of me rambling, without further ado, let's get to it. Okay so the song is in standard tuning and for the intro and you know the first half of the verse we're just going to need two chords, we're going to need a D chord and we're going to need a G chord. Now it's up to you what G chord you use, I'm personally using the four fingered G. And we're just going to do this with down strokes because there's a lot of stops so what we get is a D D D G G G G D. Okay, so that's what it's going to do sort of the first half of the verse. Now after the first time round there's this little sort of um, sort of three rakes down the string so we're going to mute the strings and just go three times like that. After the second time on the top E string there's a little hammer from five to eight. You can do that with your first to the little pinky or your first to the third finger, whatever you find easier. So put that together we've got we got the three rakes, second time, okay and then it does it two more times without anything, darling you've got to let me know, should I stay or should I go? If you say that you are mine, so this time we're going to go G, F back to the G, now it's up to you what F you use, you can use the barred F, I uh, personally use the F major 7 with the C bass in, so if you've never seen me do that before, take a regular F major 7, we're just going to move the 3rd finger to the 3rd fret and the A string, little pinky 3rd fret and the D, so what we get is here, I'll be there till the end of time, so you've got to let me know, this time we're going to go to an A7, should I stay or should I go? 
Okay, so that's going to be a verse. There's another verse which I'll just sing through so you can see how those chords work. It's always tease, tease, tease. You're happy when I'm on my knees. One day is fine and next is black. So if you want me off your back, so come on and let me know. Should I stay or should I go? Okay, so that's going to be all your verses. And it's the same chords for the chorus, um, but this time we're going to bring the strumming in. So what we get is, should I stay or should I go down? Should I stay or should I go down? If I go, there will be trouble. If I stay, there will be trouble. Okay, so the strumming for the chorus, I tend to do a down down or down or down down or down or down down or down or down down. If you can keep that consistent, so so down down or down or down down or down or down down. stop there at the end of the chorus and then we go back into the okay so that's you know pretty much the meat and potatoes of the song uh, there's another you know sort of couple of verses and there's a chorus there uh, there's a little sort of break bit which is just the same chords split Should I stay or should I go now? Should I stay or should I go now? If I go, the world will be trouble. If I stay, the world will be double. So you got to let me know. Should I stay or should I go? And that's pretty much all you're going to need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. You can't beat a bit of The Clash. And I always say, if you don't like this song, come on, you don't like music. Um, great song, this one. Great one to play on an acoustic guitar, on an electric guitar. Great one to play in a band. A good fun one, this. Uh, one of the more commercial songs by The Clash. This, I think it was made famous by being used in a, in a Levi's advert. So uh, there you go. Now, if you want any other Clash stuff, I have done London's Calling. If you want to go and check that one out. I Fought the Law, I think I did that one years ago, I'm going to do a sort of a retake on that one soon, that's a good one to get down, but if you've got any other requests for any other Clash songs, it doesn't even have to be Clash, it can be anything 50s to modern day, so the easiest way to put a request in is obviously comment in the video below, or if you want to find me a personal message over through those social media platforms, I suggest that at the start of the video, you're very welcome to, I always try and reply to messages, I just always point out that I do get quite a lot of requests, and I do sort of have to hem pit them a little bit. You know, some things work, some things don't. But don't let that put you off. Please do keep your requests coming because that's what keeps this channel going and it's very much appreciated. Another thing that's very much appreciated, I'll quickly mention it again. Uh, thanks to everyone who's subscribed. Uh, it really means a lot. Now, if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, please hit that little notification bell so you can keep up to date with the videos. You know, they sort of come thick and fast these days. Uh, another way is the patron thing, sorry to keep banging on about it, but if you want the chords, the lyrics and the strumming pattern to not only this song, pretty much everything I've done over the past 15, 16 months, there's well over 100 things up there now, there's sort of exclusive videos and stuff like that, what you're waiting for, there's a link in the description, a link in the comments. Uh, the super thanks link is another way that you could show your appreciation it's just under the video there you can make a small donation again very much appreciated and i always say word of mouth is a powerful thing so if you dig what i do please like and share my videos tell your friends tell your work colleagues anyone you know plays a guitar please point them in my direction i really appreciate that so that just leaves me to say whatever time of day it is you're watching whether it be morning day night thank you very much and i'll catch you all for lesson very soon take care